Hi, this is David from Helibatics.com. Today I'd like to show you how to bind the V8R4 to receiver from, from FreeSky with the Tyrannus X9D. Now here we have this, the receiver. And the first step is to uh, put a jumper on it on pins 1 and 2 like you see right here. That'll put it in D mode for binding. And I've got a servo on here just to, uh, just to demonstrate it, but you don't have to do that. Now I'm going to power the receiver up. And you see the red light come on, indicating that it's ready for binding. Now we'll turn the radio on. Welcome to Tarani's. And I'm going to bind with the internal module. So uh, we just go into the model. And make sure you're in D8 mode. As you can see here, I'm already in D8 mode. You'll need to be in D8 mode, otherwise it won't bind correctly. So now I simply go down here to the bind area and press enter. And you'll see the receiver flash, indicating that it has bound. Now at this point, you can exit out of this or turn the radio off, and then unplug your receiver, take the jumper off, and power it back up, <clears throat> and you'll see the red light flashing, indicating that there's no signal. Turn the radio back Welcome on. To and there it is, it's connected, and now we can move the servo. All right, so there you go. That's how you bind it. And the green light here indicates that the signal is being received by the radio. Every, every time it uh, gets a packet from the radio, it'll have that flashing green light. So that's, that's the normal condition. All right, hope that helps. Thanks a lot.